Hey everybody, this is round seven of Pandemic Reign of Cthulhu. Things are looking up. I've got a an occultist here. That's not cultist, but occultist, with three clue cards for Kingsport. That's the only remaining gate. So I find myself in the same in in a, in a familiar situation here, and that is that I've got lots of moves that I don't know what to do with because I need. I need clues. I don't need moves. I need clues, or actions, rather. I need the, the clues. The person with all the clue cards is the occultist right now. So I'm going to have the hunter go first. I'm going to have her do away with that Shogoth. Now that, because she's insane right now, she can't do her fancy get rid of a Shogoth in like one move or two moves or whatever, or two, two actions or whatever she, she was able to do. So I'll have her get rid of this guy for three actions. That feels better to have him off the board, honestly. It's just one one thing that I don't have to think about. So that was her third action. Or that was three actions. And then for her fourth action, she's going to move into a space with a cultist. And the advantage to that is that she doesn't have to do anything. Each turn, the first time you enter a location with no cultists. Well, that's that's not what's happening. So I don't have to roll anything for her to to figure out whether more cultists get added to the board really what i really want her to do is draw some red cards she draw she drew one red card that's a good thing i still don't have enough i've only got 3 in the occultists deck and one with the hunter so that's only four clue cards she needs somebody needs to have 5 in hand to close a gate but that's at least one on the board, and that's that's better than what we, where we were. Okay, time to summon some evil things. Graveyard and factory. Speaking of summoning evil things, I don't feel like... Factory, graveyard. I don't feel like an evil stirs card has come up recently. And I'm getting a little bit nervous, because there are definitely two more cards in this deck. So that was the hunter's turn. So now it's the cultist's turn. So for her first action, I think she might just want to get rid of a cultist because they are starting to sort of gather here in the graveyard, or the factory, rather. So she'll get rid of that one. And then she could, she can discard a card to move. Uh, buses are so confusing. I don't know why I can never remember the exact formula for buses. All right, one more time out of the rule book. Take a bus. Discard a clue card to move any location in the town pictured on the card. Or discard a clue card matching the town you are in to any location in any town. Okay, well, I don't have a clue card for Innsmouth, which would let me go anywhere. So the only thing she can do is discard a Dunwich card. Which, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking of this way because she doesn't... She's going to have to discard at some point because she's got... She'll, she'll collect cards. And I believe, because this is one, two, three... Four, five, six. So she is six turns away, six actions away from this gate. So I'm trying to cut that down. So if she takes a bus to Dunwich and goes right onto the border of Dunwich, that's one one action. Two, three, four, five. It cuts it down by by one. That's not super useful. And anyway, I need to get her and the hunter together so that they can swap Kingsport cards. So I guess I'm gonna just I'm gonna I'm gonna discard the Dunwich card. I'm gonna move this occultist here. So that's her second action is taking a bus. And then for her third action, 
she'll get rid of a cultist. And then for her fourth action, she's going to actually move into Kingsport just to be in the right sort of neck of the woods to close this gate. I don't know how useful that is, but I, f I feel like it might be a, a thing to do because maybe I can get this um, hunter down here and they can swap Kingsport cards. So I'm going to draw two cards. Oh, wow. Not an evil stirred. I thought for sure it was going to be an evil stirs. Uh, Innsmouth and Dunwich. Okay, not not super useful. Would have would have really loved a Kingport card. And now we're doing the summoning, which is the diner and the market. Market is here. Diner is there. All right, that wasn't bad. That That didn't feel too bad. We're, we're a Shogoth down, we're a Gate down, we just need a couple more clues. Let's see how it goes next time. Thanks for watching.